10 years in a military prison. That is the sentence tonight for a Marine drill sergeant that a jury has found guilty of abusing recruits. And one of those recruits was a Metro Detroit man who died during basic training last year at Paris Island. Rod Maloney here to tell us about the reaction to the verdict and about the sentencing itself. Rod. Yeah, hi, Devin. This is Raheel Siddiqui here uh, with his mom uh, before he went off to Paris Island and boot camp last year. And uh, his drill sergeant is now heading to prison as a result of his death. Now, he went to the family home in Dearborn Heights this afternoon, and nobody wanted to talk about this, and certainly nobody can blame them. But the one person who has been deeply concerned about this, been looking into it heavily, uh, did have a lot to say, and that's Congresswoman Debbie Dingell. They believe that he was running away uh, to escape having been hit by uh, the sergeant that's been convicted and was going to jump and his foot got caught in the railing. That's not a deliberate suicide. Raheel Siddiqui graduated first in his high school class, trained very hard individually prior to going to Paris Island to prepare himself, but nothing could really prepare him for what awaited him, a beyond brutal drill sergeant. He was targeting Muslims, he was calling them terrorists, he was uh, physically abusing them, quite frankly, in some ways. Uh, and the, it's, it's just dead wrong. The military court martial didn't directly tie Felix to Siddiqui's death, but did tie a number of like-minded sergeants. Testimony told of Felix hitting Siddiqui, calling him a terrorist. A Marine coroner ruled Siddiqui's death a suicide, something his family believes would never have happened. The congresswoman is looking to have that determination changed. But what I do want to do is assure other moms and dads that if their child goes into the military, man or woman, that they're going to be trained toughly but safely and that no one's going to be targeted because of their religion. Well, Gunnery Sergeant Joseph Felix had been to Iraq, uh, had served about 15 years in the military. Uh, he has been demoted now to private. They took away all of his pay, and he's also going to be dishonorably discharged. Back to you. Uh, Rod, the family recently sued the Marines as well, right? Yeah, they did. For $100 million is the amount on the lawsuit. Now, we heard from the family lawyer this afternoon, and he said that there was a lot that did not come out in this trial. And it's important to point out that the, that the death here was not directly linked to the drill sergeant. And I know that that's something that the attorneys are deeply concerned about. They want a jury to hear more because they believe that this family deserves far better than yeah, what they received yeah. in this situation. All right, Rod.